Hi guys, Mike Lee Kenemek, moving his life. It is Thursday morning, shit for giggles video. Okay, so uh, last weekend I was in New Jersey and I ran a seminar there. And on the second half of the seminar, it was active shooter battle mode drills outside. We had a big, huge uh, piece of grass and we did battle mode uh, drills. And I also explained that since the shooting at MSD on uh, Valentine's Day a couple of years ago here in Parkland, I no longer walk around the way I used to walk around. If you know me well, you know I love flip-flops. And for many, many, many years, I only walked around all day long in flip-flops. Okay, since the shooting, I don't walk around anymore in flip-flops. I actually wear sneakers all day long. And the only time I get to be barefooted is really when I'm on the mat. Okay, so how that's the shit for giggles for today? unconventional workout okay i'll explain i absolutely hate 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 commercial gyms i just i just hate them i hate the fact that people go over there and they fuck around instead of working out uh, i'm a guy i want in and out i want to pound it i don't want to socialize when it's workout time it's work time not socialized time that's just me okay so a uh, long time ago i used to work out at BB3 in Western, it's run by, it used to be run by uh, Billy Back the Third, and I absolutely loved that gym because it was like, like more of a secluded gym, uh, but Billy has moved to Fiji and is now the personal assistant and personal trainer to Tony Robbins, so that gym is no longer in existence. So since then, I have not gone to any other gym but work out on my own. Okay, that brings us to unconventional equipment and unconventional fitness, okay? A lot of people ask me, you know, sir, I got a bad shoulder, this and that. I have been protecting my shoulders for years and years now. I have friends uh, that have bad shoulders. Uh, some of them are fighters, some of them are athletes. And I always looked at them and said, okay, they're getting hurt in the shoulders. How can I prevent hurting my shoulders? Okay, when it comes to shoulder workouts, I do unconventional fitness. I don't do the traditional heavy dumbbells, military press and stuff like that. I do unconventional so i'm going to show you a stack that i do i do five sets of those i'm going to demonstrate one set and i'll break it down a little bit and then if you have access to those unconventional equipment you can actually duplicate that workout this is a shoulder workout okay the first set is going to be 10 here okay i take a mind i get in a fighting stand my real heel is up so i'm engaged one two three four five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Other side, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Drop. Next is the mace, 360. Eight of them, eight of them. Shh, one, shh, two, shh, three, shh, four, Five, six, seven, eight. Other side. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Next, kettlebells. Six of those. One, two, three, four, five, six. And there you have it. Okay, I'll explain. The first exercise I did is a mind, land mind, pressing the bar. I keep my heel up so it duplicates a punch. Very good for punching, very good for punching. Then the mace 360 is for mobility in my shoulders. Absolutely love the mace. Then finally, the double kettlebell, okay. Each one of those kettlebell are not the same weight. One is heavier, one is lighter. So it engages your core more. What I did is I cleaned it on the press up, explosive. On the way down, shh, slow. Explosive, slow. So you have 
10, 8. So it's 10 on each side, that's 20. 8 on each side, that's 16. And finally here, 6 straight up. I do four sets of those. Four sets of those. Really, really good shoulder workout. Doesn't hurt your shoulders. Gives you explosiveness for punching. And you don't have to go to a commercial freaking gym where people wait in line for the fucking dumbbells. Anyway, shit for giggles. Unconventional fitness. I absolutely love kettlebells. If you know me, you know I love kettlebells. I've been falling in love with the steel mace for the last year. It helps helping me out with my mobility. And obviously, you have the barbell. My click and egg, movement is life, four sets of those, once a week, good for your shoulders.